Hello guys welcome in this video. In this video we are going to solve overheating problem while gaming and loading heavy tasks in 5 easy way. Let's begin. Open control panel. Make view by to large icons. Click power options. Now click create a power plan. Type any desired name and plan name and choose high performance. Click next. Make these all to never. Then click create. Click change plan settings. Then advanced power settings. Now follow me. Guy's processor state is responsible to increase or decrease CPU speed. Let's observe it from Task Manager. 100% means processor is at max speed and consuming high power. And it will generate more heat. Let's decrease its value and see what happens. CPU speed is decreasing. It came to around 2.51 from 2.59 GHz. Guys as we decrease the value, CPU speed will fall and become quite unstable. The appropriate range is between 80 and 95. In my case, I will use 85. Guys, I will also suggest to use between 85 and 90, and if it generating more heat then, you can decrease the value. Use same value in minimum and maximum processor state. Now click apply. Turbo Boost is a feature in some processors that increases the clock speed of CPU at the maximum level on its capacity. However, Turbo Boost consumes more power and generates more heat. So, it is better to disable if we don't have proper cooling system. At first let's check Turbo Boost is enabled or not. For that open Task Manager. Go to Performance tab. Here if real-time speed is greater than default speed then Turbo Boost is enabled, or you have overclocked your processor else real-time speed is less or equal to default speed then Turbo Boost is disabled or not supported by your processor. In my case it's enabled so let's disable it. Guys, Turbo Boost can be disabled from BIOS and third-party software like Throttle Stop. I am using Throttle Stop to disable it. Open the software. Then simply check Disable Turbo and click Save. Now, exit Throttle Stop and let's open Task Manager. Here you can see guys Turbo Boost is disabled. The bloating Windows is a process of removing pre-installed Microsoft apps and services that keeps running in background. They consume more resources resulting in overheating of CPU. So, let's debloat Windows. Open PowerShell as administrator. Then copy the code from the description of this video and paste here. Press enter and wait some time. Now, click remove bloatware with customized blacklist. It took short time in my case because I had already removed bloatware. Then disable Cortana. Guys if you don't use OneDrive then it is better to uninstall it. Click Disable Telemetry Task. Then unpin Title from Start menu. Finally remove Bloatware Reg Keys. Now close all. Guys now we are going to disable Windows Animation and other effects from Advanced System Settings. Open Run. Then type System Properties Advanced. Click OK. Click Settings under Performance. Now choose Adjust for Best Performance. Click Apply. Guys let's configure Virtual Memory. Go to Advanced. Then click Change. Select Custom Size and Open Calculator. Then type 1536 times the size of your RAM. I have 8GB RAM, so I will type 8. 
Now type the product in initial size and final size. Click set. Then click OK. Guys now we will change some windows settings. Open settings. Go to system. Click notifications and actions. Now disable notification. Uncheck all three boxes. Then go to personalization. Click colors. Now disable transparency effects. Then go to privacy. Scroll down till you find background apps. Now disable apps to run in background. Similarly, go to update and security. If your Windows is up to date then you can pause Windows update. The best thing you can do is to check update once a week and after you update then again pause the update. Now minimize settings and open the game which you play. Like, I play Valorant, so I am going to open Valorant. After the game completely opens then press Windows plus D. Open Task Manager. Then right click the game. Click go to details. But if go to details is grayed out. Then expand the process. Now right click the process which is using higher CPU and RAM. Then go to details. Right click the process and click properties. Now select the process name and copy it. Then go to process. Select the game and click end task. Close task manager and open settings. Go to Windows Security and follow me. Now click add an exclusion. Click process. Then paste the process name here. Click add. Now close the settings. Guys we have done some steps to fix overheating. Also I am giving some tips here. Like reapplying thermal paste and cleaning fan. If you have laptop, then keep it on hard and flat surface, and you can also try completely charging your laptop then disconnecting the charger and play the game. I think guys these all will help you to fix overheating without undervolting your processor. Meet you in next video love you guys.